ChatGPT continues to be a hot topic when it comes to the world of content creation. And as it's been refined and been on the market longer, more and more people are utilizing the software. As AI has continued to evolve, we've seen integration with ChatGPT in tons of different places, including WordPress. You can use ChatGPT in so many different ways, everything from researching blog post ideas to generating outlines as well, and other things such as debugging code, creating plugins, SEO optimization, and so much more. There are many different ways that you can utilize ChatGPT for your website, but most of them rely on using OpenAI's interface to do so. But today I wanna to focus on how you can utilize all the power of ChatGPT right inside of WordPress itself. Now, the first way that we can do this is with Divi AI. This integrates ChatGPT 3.5 right inside of your visual builder, so you can generate text on the fly. It can also be used to build a web page, write a blog post, or simply improve copy that you've already written. You can use Divi AI to create posts or pages, but today we'll create a page. So I'm gonna walk you through this process real quick and we'll just create a new page. From here, we'll give it a title and we'll use the Divi Builder. So I'll just use a pre-made layout for this. And today I'm gonna to use the ramen shop layout. Then I'll simply click use this layout. Now, one of the fastest ways you can use ChatGPT in WordPress is to generate copy automatically. So we can select a text block that we wanna use and open up the module settings. And then up here, we can click generate content with AI. Once you do that, a new dialog box will appear with AI generated text. As you can see, it used our other elements within the layout pack to create copy directly associated with the content on the page. If I wanna use this, I can just simply click use this text and you can see it automatically inputs it into the text field. Now, another powerful thing you can do with copy and Divi AI is to improve copy that you've already written. So if we already like this text, what we can do is go over here to AI, click the button, and we have options to improve this with AI. So I'll click improve with AI and a new dialog box will appear. From here, you can choose what kind of content this is, anything from a paragraph, title, button, and more. Here you can tell it what you're writing about, which allows you to provide context to give Divi AI a better shot at producing what you want. From here, you can choose how much of the page context you want it to take into account. And then under Guide Me, you have even more options. You can change the tone of voice if you want. If there are any keywords that it has to include, you can put those in here. If you have a specific content length you want, you can choose that right here as well. And you can even change the language as well. These settings really allow you to fine tune your copy that are generated with Divi AI or that are written by a human. The great thing about ChatGPT within Divi AI is that you can guide it using keywords and other settings to produce content more attuned to your needs. Some other powerful things you can do here are some quick actions. So let's say for instance, we wanted to shorten this. We can go down here and click shorten. So a new dialog box will appear. And from here, we can just use this text and you can see that it automatically shortened our copy a little bit for us. Now, another good way you can use ChatGPT in WordPress is through a plugin called AI Engine. This allows you to create chatbots, generate blog post ideas, and create images. First, in order to use AI Engine though, you'll need to obtain an API key through OpenAI and purchase some credits. So first of all, I'm just gonna install the AI Engine plugin. Now, once it's installed, we'll go over to the sidebar here and go to the AI Engine dashboard. So then you just need to have an OpenAI account. So if you click the link here, it'll take you to their website to create an account or log in and to get our API key. Once you're logged in, you can create your API key, or if you already have one, you can get it from here. Then once you have your API key, go back to your AI Engine dashboard, and under settings, we'll put in our API key here. So now that AI Engine is all set up, we can start generating content. So at the top right of your screen though, you can see this and we'll click content. This will take you to the AI Engine content generator. Over here is where you can start by adding a topic for your content you wanna generate. Down here, you can create new templates based on current settings. Up here's the title where you can insert a title for your content. Here under sections is where you can input text to rewrite it using ChatGPT or have the AI generate it for you. Content is where your body of your content goes. Excerpt is used to generate post excerpt. Down here in this box, if you click that, you can choose between posts, pages, groups, memberships, and projects. This box right here is where you can switch between posts and pages. This is the button where you'll press when you wanna create the post. And then over here on the right, we have some content parameters. You can choose between your language, the writing style you want it to have, and the tone of the writing itself. Also, since it does run on a token system, down here's the usage cost, which will allow you to see the cost of the current generation before you do it. So let's use this to generate a topic. I'll use what I did earlier and we'll do Japanese cooking and I'll click generate. So you can see it generated a title for us right here. It then gave us some sections, which you can choose your number of sections from here and gave us some content as well here. You can also use it to generate an excerpt, which it's done right here. And then if you're happy with it, you can click create post. As you can see, it's also relatively inexpensive. So for this generation, it costs us less than a penny. So we can click create post if we like it. It'll make us a post 
And let's go and edit it real quick. And here you can see in just a couple of minutes, we've created a post using AI Engine. Another cool feature of AI Engine is the ability to create a chat bot to display on your website. It only takes a few minutes and can help customer engagement by answering questions, pointing customers to a specific product or service and more. You can access this if you go back to the Meow Apps AI Engine dashboard here. And then under chatbots, you have all your chatbot settings. There are a whole lot of different chatbot settings that you can play with so that you can make it match your website branding and do all the things that you want it to do. With the emergence of ChatGPT, it has shaken up the content creation world for both individuals and businesses. AI content generation tools aren't going anywhere and now they're becoming easier and easier to use with tools that I showed you today, such as Divi AI and AI Engine. Hopefully this video helped you figure out how to use ChatGPT within WordPress. Thank you so much for watching. And before you go, make sure you like the video and leave a comment down below letting me know what kind of things you want to use ChatGPT for. And I'll see you in the next one.